Welcome to this Windows channel and this is a quick update to talk about Chrome 60. If you are a Google Chrome user and there's a really really huge chance that you are one, there is a new version of Chrome 60 available for Windows 7, 8 and 10, 32 and 64 bits, which moves the version to 60. So that's what you see here, 60.0.3112.78. It was released today and um, it doesn't have any visual front-facing features really but it does have under the hood code um, changes 40 security issues are fixed in here so it's kind of important to upgrade your Google Chrome browser to this one because of just the 40 security issues that are fixed in here um, there's an addition of Paint Timing API, a new tool for website developers that will allow them to measure the time Chrome takes to paint their web page. So that means if you actually have um, or create web pages, that new feature will enable anyone that creates a web page to see how long does it take for your page to actually be displayed, which is very useful information and you know might help you create a page that actually displays faster. Uh, there is a CSS font display property that now allows developers to tell Chrome to display a default uh, operating system font while the browser downloads custom fonts in the background. All sorts of uh, all sorts of things like payment request API now available, meaning you will do in um, in 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 app or in Chrome payments available. Also available, by the way, for uh, uh, Chrome on other devices. If you have a Mac, the big, big new feature in Chrome is that that famous touch bar on the newest MacBooks, you will be able to use that and it will actually have functionalities for Google Chrome. So that's uh, a, a very nice uh, thing. And finally, they are supporting a host of all sorts of new timing functionalities. But one that is interesting, a new uh, string uh, format called VP9 which is a royalty free video coding format and it will now be you, you'll be able to use it now natively within Chrome uh, with the MP4 uh, container so basically uh, just a host of internal stuff but mostly what I would say is make sure that um, that you upgrade because at least of the 40 security fixes uh, many of them very very high in the ranking of problems so uh, make sure that you actually upgrade at least for the security reasons because on the rest you won't see any difference for your Google Chrome browser in general so uh, just head on to the uh, little settings menu on the upper right corner of your screen go into help there you'll click about Google Chrome and it should want to update once you do this if it hasn't updated by itself. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up, and thank you for watching.